There is some more evidence of a theory that I've been going about for the last year or so, and increasingly we seem to be getting empirical evidence pointing in that direction. So my belief, which is fairly a fairly educated belief, but it's still speculation, is that artificial intelligence isn't going to just snatch up jobs. It's not going to take Colin's job in accountancy and Colin's out on the street. It's going to be more subtle. My opinion is that it's going to erode the entry-level jobs and we are going to see the bottom of the pyramid of every organization, of every industry, being eroded out because less people are coming in at the entry-level position. A new study from Harvard with 285,000 firms, data over 62 million workers. So th this is what they've used. And what it's showing is junior roles are down by 23%. So less people are being hired at the lower levels of a firm whereas senior roles are up by 14%. So there is continued hiring at the higher levels of an organization, but in the lower levels of these organizations, it's down by a quarter because artificial intelligence can do the job of entry-level workers. We've seen in the US, the Department of Labor and Statistics posted new job creation statistics for the last few months, and it's been going down. The normal number of new jobs averages around 150,000. I believe the latest figure is 22,000, and prior to that it was... 30 or 40. So it is collapsing. Jobs are not being made. New jobs are not being made. So it looks like, and this is to do with coding in particular, before you'd have one senior, you would have three juniors underneath them to have a team of four. You can have one senior plus Claude or an artificial intelligence and you do not need those additional people because your seniors have a higher productivity so you don't need to increase headcount. And one of the most expensive things about running a business is headcount. If you can reach the same level of productivity using artificial intelligence, your profits would skyrocket because you're not paying salaries. You've got an AI cost of a few thousand pounds a month, but that is nothing compared to having people on the books. So we're seeing a correlation. We're seeing the rise of artificial intelligence in organizations and a decrease in entry-level jobs. We do not necessarily know that there's a causation there. Just because we have a correlation doesn't mean there's a causation. There are ways to test. And obviously, the more data we get, the more we can test that. But what it looks like, at least from this study, is that the, there is a kind of a very tight correlation. There are still causes that it could be. Interest rates, overhiring, general economic malaise, etc. Even if those are in play, AI is not going to help. I can't see any reason why AI would increase the number. The directionality is probably in favor of this study. If AI is not going to be helping create new jobs, it is going to be destroying new jobs.